channel. I am Professor Sasikla Sandosh from Sakti Institute. Today I am going to teach you about the daily usage of direct and indirect speech. How we are going to use indirect and indirect speech in our daily speech. Okay. Shall we go to our class? Daily usage of direct and indirect speech. An Indian said to us, India will be a developed country. An Indian said to us that uh, India will be a developed country. Mother, Mother Teresa said to us that uh, God loves all. Ronald said to them, I will be a winner forever. Ronald said to them that he will be a winner forever. The software engineer says to me, I am a hard worker. I said to Vinaveda, she is my friend. Sita said to Niveda that she was her friend. Now look here. An Indian said to us, India will be a developed country. Abhina inna, or Indian sorra inna ne, India inni mele, pala mana nade, nunu pala nada ayo, abhin sorra, develop ayo, nunu sorra. An Indian said to us that India will be a developed country. Abhina inna, India or pala mana nade ayo. An Indian said to us that India will be a developed nation. Abhina, India will be a developed nation. Here I am using the word connecting verb that here said to and said to. Both are same. Same words only I am using here as the reporting verb. Okay. Here Mother Teresa said to us God loves all. Mother Teresa said to us that God loves all. அப்படின்னா <laughs> உழைக்கிறார் <laughs> Okay, am is changed into is. Note this. Sita said to Niveda, she is my friend. Sita said to Niveda that she was her friend. Here Sita is telling to Niveda that she is her friend. Okay. Sita yana solra, Niveda kita solra. Yana solra, she is my friend. Ava yam friend de abdeen soli solra. Sita said to Niveda that she was her friend. Here said this the reporting verb. Past tense. So here was is coming. So, Sita said to Niveda that she was her friend. That is Sita Niveda said to Niveda that she was her friend. That is Sita Niveda said to Niveda that she was her friend. That is Sita Niveda said to Niveda that she was her friend. Daily usage of direct and indirect speech using imperative sentences. Krishna said to Arjuna, do your duty. Krishna ordered Arjuna to do his duty. The baby said to her mother, Give Vanu biscuits. The baby requested her mother to give Vanu biscuits. The doctor said to the patient, relax please. The doctor advised the patient to take rest. The inspector said to the police, regulate the traffic. The inspector commanded the police to regulate the traffic. Now Krishna said to Arjuna, do your duty. Krishna sonna, order panna, adhikarama sonna, ena chandhe, um vele ni paar, abhi sonna. Aba Krishna said to Arjuna, do your duty, um vele ni paar. The doctor said to the patient, relax please. Abhi na doctor ena sonna re, koja rest heads konga, abhi sonna re. The doctor advised the patient to take rest. Abhi na doctor kethi kira re, abhi sonna re, nika rest heads konga, abhi nanda sonna re. The inspector said to the police, regulate the traffic. Inspector said to the police, traffic is regulated, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay, it's okay. The inspector commanded the police to regulate the traffic. Now, the police said to the command, that's the command. 